Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the concept of syntax tree or abstract syntax tree or directed acyclic graph. So basically, these are nothing but the compressed versions of a parser trees, guys. Okay, so okay, so DAG is one of the most compressed version, guys, to be specific. Okay, yes. So basically, if you observe here, ID plus ID into ID. Okay, so assume the given grammar is not normal grammar. That is nothing but E implies E plus a T and T implies a T into F. E implies a T and a T implies a F and F implies ID. Right. So this is the standard grammar which we will be using. Okay, so assume that the parse tree will be looking in this way. So E in implies a E plus a T and T implies a T into E and it will be extending in this way. So whereas the syntax tree will be in this way, right? So only the operation. So basically here ID into ID will be having high precedence. So that is calculated first and then this result will be calculated. Yes. So similarly DAG. So the only thing that you should remember is in a DAG for each and every variable, you will be defining only once guys. If there is a change in it, you will be replacing it. You will be defining it multiple times. Else, if it is if there is no change in the value, then only once you will be defining, guys. Okay. So here ID. Okay. So ID into ID. So ID into ID is ID. Sorry, ID into ID is collected, and that result will be added, guys. So that is nothing but the value. So ID into ID will be stored in this, and one more ID plus the result is nothing but our required ID. Got it? Yes. Okay. So this is one more example guys you can say in syntax uh, tree or root parent internal nodes are operators leaf nodes are operands okay so a into b plus c or t so initially b plus c is calculated okay into a is a done and then it in by d okay right okay so i hope everyone got a clear idea on this syntax tree so in the next lecture we will be discussing about post fix notation guys okay so let us meet in the next lecture thank you thanks for watching